Alright, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the DGL. My name is Link, and we've got a great matchup for you today. It's going to be Ta versus Cryo. This is going to be a pretty big matchup here. Whoever wins this... I think it's going to be moving on to the Premier League playoffs. So definitely an important match. On the blue side, Ta. We have Face Palm, Doug, Muzzle, I, Boris, and Torn. On the Insurgent side, we've got Cryo, New Spark, Asian, Malbeast, Party, and Cuckoo. So both these teams. Pretty experienced, doing so well um, this season. They've come such a long way, practicing a lot and learning a lot. Um, coincidentally enough, in uh, part one of season 11, Cryo actually lost to Ta. Um, the score was 11 to 8 on Ministry. Ta won, beating Cryo on Ministry. Um, in the end, though, Ta was ranked 6th out of 12 teams, just barely making it into Premier League. Um, and Cryo was ranked 4th out of 12 teams. So, part 2 of Premier... This is now Premier League, and they're battling their way to make it to playoffs. So it should be a very interesting game. I'm not sure. What are your predictions in chat? you guys predict we've got a lot of love for probably both teams here so there's a three minute delay on stream so bear in mind <laughs> that's some uh, tall lovers in the chat. So. Just waiting on this pistol round. For those of you that do not know, but most of you do, this is 5v5 competitive firefight. Custom theater. No explosives. It's going to be a best of 20. 10 round halves. First to 11 wins it. A pistol round is used to determine what side these teams will be starting on. So, looks like they're waiting for a fifth player. I don't think New Spark is actually going to be playing. So, yeah, should be here soon. Waiting on these two teams. So, what are your predictions in uh, chat? See how I sound really quick. Up here, whoever wins this, I think. Looks like I probably need to turn my volume up a little bit on the in-game sound. Of course, everyone has silencers, so. Face palm with the Makarov. Is everybody excited for Sandstorm? I am pretty excited for this beta coming up this weekend. I might actually be streaming uh, 24 hours. I'm not sure yet. I did get Friday off, so we'll see. We will see. What's up, Sudsies? Uh, Caitlin, F. Dud, and Reason. What's up, what's up, what's up, what's up? I'm actually going to pause this here. So, still waiting. Should be live here any second. Looks like they are going to go live in the pistol round, but because the timer is out, they're going to have to kill out. Pistol round, use the determined sides. 5v5, competitive insurgency firefight thing. 
you're watching the DG DGL. I cannot speak tonight. Sorry, it's been a while since I've actually shoutcasted. The DGL Premier League Tall versus Cryo. So let's see here. It looks like we're going to be going live into the pistol round. P. Lore. Here we go. There's those predictions coming out. Three minute delay. So I'm I'm seeing what you're typing to me three minutes later. 11-8 Ta. Pretty interesting. Fun facts for you guys just tuning in. Um, Cryo actually lost to Ta in part one. 11-8. So that was on ministry. So here we go. Pistols live. Let's see who wins the pistol round. And see what side they like to uh, start on. Not a lot of teams favoring that insurgent side. So, who will get the first pick? There's the face bomb pushing on to B. It's going to be a quick fight here. Ooh, right on to T2. He's pushing in. Face bomb looking for the kill. Not going to find one. Staying alive with that heavy armor on B. Doing a good job of staying alive. But Asian now up above him. Needs to look down on the B. He's going to. And gets the kill. Meanwhile, in apps. Torn looking away from apps. Getting taken down. I have Horus all by himself. Heavy armor almost to his downfall. And he's actually going to get taken down so cryo is going to be able to choose what side they want to start out on so let's we're trying out here something ladies and gentlemen let's see that replay again so i have oris getting taken down at the very end of that pistol around heavy armor taking him down so yeah it looks like Cryo is going to want to stay on Insurgents. So I feel like most teams do like doing this. So. Let's see what these guys got here. Should be Lore here in a second. Yo, I'm loading. Super excited for Sandstorm this weekend. Going to grind that matchmaking. All right. I guess we'll give him a shout out once again. Ta on the blue team security. Ivoris, face bomb, Doug, muzzle, and torn. On the yellowish, orangish, yellowish team insurgents. Cryo. Asian Malbeast, Boz, aka Demonics, Party, and Cuckoo. Cuckoo. For Cocoa Puffs. All right, here we go live, ladies and gentlemen. Zero, zero. Here we go. Let's see what these teams set up in the beginning. Being in the games, usually trying to fill out one another. Not fill one another, just fill out one another. Will we see any cross picks coming across the board? Doesn't look like it. Looks like Boz is actually going to try and go for a cross pick. Muzzle now staying down on B. Cuckoo deep in enemy territory. Face bomb getting a kill. And look at Cuckoo playing aggressive on the balcony. He broke that pot. Did not like that pot. Meanwhile, Doug killing apps. He's got to be careful of this balcony player. He's going to get taken down. Did Muzzle touch B? No, Muzzle actually did not touch B. He got a call out for this balcony player. So now Insurgents on B. It's a 3v3 situation, so could be anyone's game. I have Oris. There we go. Muzzle pushing down on a cubby. He gets one kill, jumps up, gets another kill. Two big kills for Muzzle. Now Cuckoo all by himself. They have to decap B, though, unfortunately. So Cuckoo is actually going to go to A. This is the smart choice. They just flipped B. So what is Ta going to do? Insurgents are capping A right now. Looks like Eye of Oris may come back. Torn is going to go to C? Hmm, there he goes. There's the call that goes to C. A and B are going to cap nearly at the same time. So 
Yeah, there's the cap. Cuckoo's gonna cap as well. Ivoris is pushing back to A. Meanwhile, C is at 50%. Now, Cuckoo's gonna try and spawn camp here. He actually got shot at by Ivoris from behind. Will he be able to get any kills? Gets one! Gets two! Ivoris is gonna go back. Meanwhile, on the barber side, Party gets taken down, and the Malbeast trades. Torn getting more kills. So now it's a 2v2 situation. I have Oris trying to cap A. So Cryo's going to have to do something here. Cuckoo trying to make his way back to A. I think they're going to run out of time here, actually. Cuckoo trying to push in. He's going to throw that flashbang. Is he going to make it? I think he will. Oh, he barely makes it. Cuckoo just has to stay alive. Meanwhile, Torn pushes on C, but he gets picked. Now, oh, why did he push? He pushed and got taken out. Cuckoo did not actually have to do that. What an amazing round, ladies and gentlemen. Ta taking that first round. I just want to highlight something here. Um, Muzzle just jumping down into Cubby. I barely caught it. Look, he kills one, jumps over, and gets another kill. Amazing play from muzzle unfortunately cuckoo there at the end of the round no need for him to push like that cuckoo was on the objective and there was the timer was at zero so cuckoo just had to delay malbeast had just capped the objective um and cry was on their way back so pretty interesting what's up obi-wan jacoby Muzzle pushing down on to B. There's that crossfit coming out. Muzzle playing right on to B. Look at Cuckoo playing so aggressive. Getting the kill on to B. Is he going to push cafe or balcony? He's going to push up to balcony. Looking for this player. Doesn't see him. Oh, he takes him down. Two kills. Meanwhile, face palm over on apps. I have Oris taking down Malbeast. Face palm getting taken down from apps. I have Oris all by himself. Ivoris is going to push across. He's got to be careful. This player is right next to him. Asian is going to take him out. Cuckoo. Getting so many kills that round. Oh, that is Zoo. Yeah, Cuckoo is Zoo. I can't keep track of all you players changing your name. Okay? Cuckoo, do you love me? So one to one right now. There's the score there. Cuckoo, aka Zoo, pushing through B, getting two kills, really helping her team there. Boss with no kills. Oh. One to one. A lot of teams favor the insurgent side. You notice that Cryo did elect to stay on insurgents. Some pre-fire coming out by Ta. Oh, look at Torn. Torn next level here. Muzzle definitely called out that player in checkers. Torn is actually leaning. He's got to be careful. He's making a lot of noise. Oh my goodness. He actually flanked Malbeast. Meanwhile, 4v4, Torn trying to push around. Oh, almost getting the kill. He actually shot the um, door frame. Zoo playing around B in this position. I really like this position she's in. Not a lot of players play it. It's kind of a weird position. 4v3. Face bomb trying again to slowly push through apartments. Oh, Doug got picked off by party. Face bomb's creeping through here. Oh, look at face bomb playing passive. Oh, is he getting another kill? Oh, unfortunately gets picked off from balcony by Boz. Boz getting that kill. Cryo now up two to one. Let's. <laughs> 
What's up, Zapatista? I know, yeah. Cuckoo is actually a zoo. It's not my fault. So, look at this play. Uh, I don't know if I captured it. Let me see if I, I got it on camera here. Torn, pushing into tires and just running around like that. Unfortunately, he got, gets picked off after that. Um, but I don't think uh, Asian has actually heard him. <laughs> so there's the score one to two in favor of cryo so just a very hard balcony pressure here what is is doug actually going to throw this oh he almost makes it land oh my gosh torn running through tires gets two kills killing malbeast and zoo Look at him playing back here again. They got killed from here last time. He's saying, not again. Oh my goodness, Torn saw him. Misses, sprays wildly. Not gonna get the kill. Oh. Torn got three kills that round. Face bomb going down. Are they gonna play A here? Looks like Boz is going to go to A. Meanwhile, Party is looking for Torn. Torn is just kind of hiding. Not really want to expose himself. Will Party see him? No, he will not. Now, Taw, security is not on an objective right now. They need to get on an objective. Ooh, Doug is actually going to go through the front. This is pretty dangerous. Coming in through the front here. Oh, there he goes. He's going to elect to go back. Now he's going to have a left peek. And he's going to get taken down by Party. Good cover by Party. Too little too late. Torn getting on the objective. So. Cryo in excellent position. Look at the spawn camp up here. Yeah. Muzzle actually calling it out. So. There is Torn. Let's see what, what Party can do here. Party playing in the crack. He's going to let one go. Misses the first one. He's going to run away. He doesn't want any part of that. And Party trying to look for a kill. Running around. Finally gets picked off by Doug. Can Torn find this other player? Oh, no. He misses Asian. Torn actually got five kills that round. And I somehow missed all of them. Oh, my goodness. They need to get on an objective. Oh, I have Oris getting on the objective at the very last second. Now Muzzle going to touch this objective. Asian's going to be split here. He's going to have to kill C and then go to B. We'll see. What is he going to like to do? Looks like he's trying to figure out what he wants to do. He's going to look over and get killed. What a comeback from Ta. Oh my goodness. That was amazing. So that back and forth gameplay, just incredible. I mean, Torn, but Torn got four kills? Uh, excuse me, I thought he got five that round. Torn got four kills for his team, and I didn't capture any of them. He's probably going to message me later about how he's angry about that. And see, the problem here is there's a shoutcaster curse, right? If you do good one round, and then they spectate you, you, you die instantly the next round. So let's see if, if Torn does not care about that curse. So, oh. kills pretty evenly spread on the cryo team. Torn doing work for his team here. Now, see, I am spectating him now. So we will see what he can do. Look at him. Oh, he's going to miss the kill onto Zoo. Zoo's going to get across. Torn electing to come up here. He's got to be careful. Trying to come up. He hasn't died yet. It is 5v4 with the advantage for cryo. Oh, Party jumping across. He's going to get the kill onto Doug. Doug getting taken down. He's running up. Gets two kills. Party getting two kills in apartments. Now running around. Is he going to flank tires or go to B? Looks like he is going to go to B. Meanwhile, I have Oris pushing through balcony. He's going to get taken down by Malbeast. It's only Torn. Torn again all alone. Trying to do something and make it happen. Once again, this guy's here. Finally connecting with Asian. 
That's the third duel he's tried to have there on that apartments player. Meanwhile, Torn going to C. Looks like Zoo will go to B. We've got Party on C and Malpeace coming in to block on to C. So Malpeace is going to jump in. Oh, he prones and gets the kill. Oh my goodness, the link prone at the end. I'm sorry. I mean, I feel like I mean, I feel like we got to show that one on cam, right? I mean, the link prone by Malbeast at the end. Coming in, just a li he's like, looks around. He's like, what? Goes prone, gets the kill, ends the round. Um, so now Cryo up one point. This is back and forth gameplay. I hope you guys brought food and water because we're going to be in here for the long haul. Oh, Malbeast doing a great job at the end there. Five rounds to go in this half. Cryo up three to two. Still anyone's game. Teams favoring that insurgent side. Pay a little attention. Malby's getting that kill at the end here. Is he going to elect to run through tires? Looks like he is. Oh man, he's in the perfect position. He actually gets the kill on the face palm, but it's still a 4v3. He's going to get another kill. Malbeast pulling it for his team. He's going to come up at the back here. He's got to kill this player. That's three kills for Malbeast this round. Now blocking B. Ivoris by himself. B is at 50% for security. So Ivoris has time. Pressure is going to be on here soon, though. Asian is actually in apartments. Ooh, I have Oris. Gotta be careful. He was spotted by Malbis. Malbis trying to find his fourth kill in this round. Oh, and I have Oris getting taken down. Now Cryo up. Two to four. Malbeast getting three kills that round. Almost getting a fourth. We did capture on camera there the first two kills he got. Kills that first player into Cubby. Meanwhile, Torn tries to jump across, and he gets taken down. So a great play by Malbeast there in tires. So also a big shout-out to Jims for that awesome DGL transition gra graphic. Jims, you're amazing. Two to four. Two, two, four. What are your predictions so far? I mean, after you guys see this, it's kind of could be really anyone's game, right? So, no cross picks coming out anymore. These teams are just going at it. There's a cross pick coming out early. It's a little late, actually. Excuse me. Zoo pushing on. Is she gonna get a kill? Kills one through the flashbang. There's still another player on. Zoo desperately trying to stay alive. She's getting picked from Cafe, but not dying. Oh, she finally gets taken down. Meanwhile, Asians looking for the kills here. Did Zoo give a call out? Zoo pushing in, sh or excuse me, Asian shooting at everything. Gets a second kill. Now it's a 3v2. Oh my goodness, this is so action packed. He's got to be careful of this balcony player. Doug needs to look down. Meanwhile, we've got a fight on A. A is not blocked. So Torn is trying to creep on. There we go. He's going to get the block. And now here comes Doug from behind. Is he going to pre-fire? There goes a nade. Doug comes in gets the kill. Watch out for the nade, though. Oh, my goodness. He somehow stays alive. Party now on B. Ooh, looks like they're not going to decap. This is actually – this will be a little confusing. Um, Doug's going to run straight on. Oh, he's actually going to get in. He's going to prone right next to his player. Oh, he gets the kill. Now it's Torn. Does Torn know where he is? He's on barrel. Torn's got to stay alive. This is a clutch moment. 1v1 situation. Looks away. Gets taken down by Asian. Now up three rounds. Three rounds in a row for Cryo. Five to two. So, wow. I don't. I don't know if there wasn't a call out there. Um, 
Torn ran in there when he was shooting, so I don't know if he thought he was apps or, or what. They didn't call out that B, B was clear. So. Asian getting two kills that round. From that tires position. Looks like Cryo is playing tires so well right now. Um, Torn had some good rounds. It's really, I guess it's really just been a back and back between the two teams. So. Boss trying to get that cross pick. Is he going to get one? Aiming a little to the right. He saw that player walk into B. Look at Asian looking down. Asian trying to find a kill. Malby's killing Torn. So Absent Tires now in full control. And it's just I have Oris quickly cryo killing. All up tall. Now B again in their favor. I have Oris should be running straight to C. He needs to go there immediately. He's taking his time here, and this actually might be his downfall. He actually lost 10 seconds there because B was capped almost 50% for security. So now C at 50%. Here he comes to save the day. Party trying to run in here. This is going to be a left peak first, right peak. Ivoris in a weird position. He saw that player. Oh my goodness. Did he not see him? Okay. All right. He capped. Ivoris just needs to sit and be careful. Oh, party saw his gun. Yep. Party sees his gun. This is a right peak versus right peak. Ladies and gentlemen, I don't think we've ever seen this before. This is equipment crossing the streets. Crap. Party. Playing so patient, coming in and getting that kill. Meanwhile, Asian on the other side, trying to look for kills. Here comes Cuckoo. Cuckoo's going to get one. Cuckoo gets two. Oh, that's Sue. Sorry. Why don't you change your name? And then Asian taking them down. Oh, man. Right peak versus right peak. Eye of Oris didn't know where they were coming from, so he kept swinging around. That's what happens when you play that middle objective. Now 6-2. to two. You can see, actually, Party can see his gun. Party playing so well and patient. Waits for it, comes in, gets the kill. Beautiful execution by Party. Great play. 2-6 to six now in favor of Cryo. I mean, what do you think a good half is here? A good half on District when you're on security. 3-7. 4-6. So... Look at Asian, Asian 14 and five. Doing work for his team right now. Let's see what we can have here. Muzzle always playing on that B objective. Oh, it looks like face bomb actually going to tires now. Are they just playing every lane? Muzzle getting taken down. So, I mean, Zeus just running all over the place. Face bomb trying to get the kill. That guy actually flashed himself. Meanwhile, Zoo getting B at 50%. Look at him. He flashed himself. Oh, face bomb pushing in, gets the kill. Way to play patient there. Yeah, it looks like he took a headshot. Face bomb needs to check B though. Unfortunately, not gonna check it. Gonna see Zoo and miss. He's out of ammo. Zoo gets another kill. Oh, Zoo is actually gonna get killed by Torn. Face bomb's gonna jump onto B. Doug killing boss. Oh, my game actually just crashed. Wow. I feel like I crash a lot more um, when I am in uh, high quality. High quality. So I'm going to relaunch this game here. Um, hopefully the Steam beta doesn't do anything. So, all right. Coming back in this game. Um, I believe, what was the end there? I think it was just, they had just capped, and they were, re face bomb was recapping. So it was a 3v4 situation. Boz got killed on balcony, um, and it looks like they're still in that game. I don't know what just happened. It looks like the round just ended, actually. Yeah, the round just ended. Cryo actually won that one at the very end. Looks like Asian got some more kills. When, we, when he respawned, he was at 15-6. So, 
It is ridiculously hot in my room right now. So it looks like Ta almost... They've had a lot of change-ups in what they're doing, and I like to see that. They're like, okay, this... This isn't working, so I'm going to try and change it up here. Um, it just looks like they're having someone new play every lane almost every round. Um, which it's it's kind of hard to to get a feel for what's going on here. Now, Muzzle's going to push in, but Zoo's going to see him and take him out. Zoo getting taken down by Eye of Oris. Torn sees this player in tires. Eye of Oris is looking for a fight here. Oh, look at this position on the barrel. He was actually seen. Gets taken down by Demonix. Now, Doug pushing into, into apartments. Looking for that frag, not going to find it. Meanwhile, Torn kills Malbeast in tires and face bomb. Getting the kill on the balcony. B at 25% right now. Doug getting the kill, and now it's just Asian by himself trying to stay alive. He prones and gets the kill. It's a 1v1. Oh my goodness. Asian proning and getting that kill onto apartments. Wow, that was sexy. Is he playing with a flashlight? So this is going to be a full reset. Just not connecting there. So. Asian now going for the spawn camp. I would like to see him touch A just to kind of bait it. There's 60 seconds remaining. Asian's going to get one kill. Almost getting flashed, but not quite. Doug getting a kill again. Or not Doug, sorry. Asian. Asian getting a kill. Finally getting taken down. Meanwhile, Cryo was trying to help Asian. They pushed all the way across. Zoo's going to get a kill, and now it's a 2v3 situation. Zoo gets taken down by Face Bomb. That's a huge kill for Face Bomb. Now it's a 2v2 situation. So they've got a good split right now. 20 seconds remaining. Cryo now in a pickle. Gonna have to decide what they want to do. Face Bomb playing on that objective. So 10 seconds, 9 seconds remaining. Looks like they're gonna double this up. Face Bomb's gonna look away. Oh, this is actually gonna work out beautifully. Party is going to get the kill, and now Torn's going to have to get on to B. Now, Party's going to probably come back. Here he comes. Torn just needs to stay down and stop moving. See, he heard him. Oh, he stands up and gets the kill! Oh, now Malbeast coming on the objective. He's blocked. Oh, it's not going to have time to react. And that is going to be the half 8-2. to two. Cryo coming up huge that round. Asian going off with that flick. Let's check that out. Asian playing on that B objective. Doug got the quick kill, but then Asian killing one, getting pre-fired, then proning and looking back up. I mean, that was a beautiful kill um, by Asian. So going into the half now, 8-2. to two. Cryo now on security. So, I mean, Cryo wants blood. In part one of season 11, Cryo actually lost to Ta. Ta beat Cryo 11 to 8. So, you know, they, Cryo wants revenge here. Don't make no mistake. It ain't revenge they're after. It's a reckoning. So, Asian getting 21 kills. Zu uh, not far behind with 14 kills. Meanwhile, Torn and I have Horus... Top fragging for the Ta team. Ta now on Insurgents. Insurgents, typically the favored side. So. Let's see here. You know what I just noticed? It says the DGL.org above their players. You guys see that? It's kind of interesting. Zoo is going to play B. She's been playing B all night. Pretty well, actually. So, muzzle playing off the objective. So, Ta kind of playing safe here. Um, and usually on insurgents, gonna want to play a little, a little more aggressive. I guess it just depends on your playstyle. Boss getting taken down 
by Eye of Oris. Now they're playing on the objective. B was at 75% in apartments. Look at Asian creeping here, trying to find a kill. He's going to find it. Now Asian, is he going to go to Cubby or is he going to go to C here? He's going to run down into Cubby and look for a kill. He's going to be jumping all over the place. Does he hear him? Oh, he gets taken down by Muzzle. Eye of Oris needs to support his teammate. His, cr his party's trying to get the pre-fire, but he's got too much to shoot through. He's not going to find a kill. Meanwhile, Malbeast pushing up into T2. Eye of Oris needs to protect his teammate. He does. He gets the kill. Meanwhile, party pushing around, trying to get the kill onto Muzzle. He's going to get it now in a 1v1 situation. Eye of Oris looking for this kill onto party. Left peek versus right peek. He's going to get the kill. Beautiful play by Ta there. Coming back, six rounds uncontested for Cryo. Now Ta switching it up, getting one round. That's the round they needed. I mean, Muzzle playing so patiently in those arches and finally getting the kill onto Zoo. I mean, she got that thing up to 75%. Um, so, I mean, that was just a beautiful play. I mean, it all through and through, that looked like Cryo's round. And then... They just kind of let it slip away. Great play by Eye of Oris. Eye of Oris pushing through and protecting his teammate on B. That was beautiful. I mean, I I would not have predicted that Tall would have won that round, but they did. That was an amazing play. So. Wow. That was just incredible play by Tall. So 8-3 to three now. Free Fire is coming through. It doesn't look like anyone's going to get picked off. Malbeast. Little spectator bug going up into the sky. Zoo's going to get that kill on some muzzle. Just been dominating B pretty much all day. So they've got no pressure on B. Doug, 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 Doogie. In apartments. <laughs> Facepalm is actually going to get naded. I have Oris is going to push through again and get killed. And Doug's going to go down. It's only torn. And he's going to jump on top of the truck and actually get killed um, by Asian. Asian actually slid, and it saved his life. So, Asian doing so well. Getting a little lucky there. Looked like a little bit of lag. Not sure if that's on my end. So... Nine to three in favor of Cryo. You know, both these teams practicing a lot this season. Um, I know that we, Veritas, scrimmed Cryo and Tall pretty regularly. So, I think Cryo had a little bit of an upper hand. Um, they were scrimming quite a lot. They have been practicing very hard for this. Um, not to say that Tall hasn't. So... Ta just needs to get a little bit more control of the map. I think they're a little bit scared right now. Um, and they're not really, you know, they're not really dominating anything. That that nade onto Muzzle. Here's a nade from Face Palm. I don't think he's going to find anyone with that. But look at Doug pushing all the way through. He should be able to flank Zoo here. He doesn't even look. He doesn't even look at B. He just passed right by Zoo. Oh, my goodness. And Zoo might get the ninja cap here. Oh my gosh, B is at 75%. They are right next to each other. No one's going to get on the objective. Oh my gosh, Zoo caps the objective at the last second. I have Oris and Doug getting a kill. But, you know, there goes the cap. So Doug's going to have to do some work here. He's making the right choice in trying to protect B, but oh, he just got distracted. That's exactly what they were trying to do. They were trying to distract him, and it worked. Doug is going to get one kill. There's going to be the recap, and now it's a 5v2 situation. So. Oh, my goodness. Boss trying to find something out of spawn here. He's, he's shooting a little, little wild. Meanwhile, Asian's just sitting up in a balcony. 45 seconds remaining on the clock. 40 seconds on the, remaining on the clock. Blue team has to do something. Security has to make a push here. If they don't, they're going to lose it. Boz looking for a kill. Oh, he gets taken off. Now it's just Asian. What can Asian do? It's 1v4, 30 seconds remaining. Asian has to make a play. He doesn't really have time to go to C. He can try. He's going to get one kill. 
Each kill he gets, though, the time is ticking down. 20 seconds remaining. Doug pushing into tires. He's got to be careful. Asian jumping, and it's actually going to get him killed. Taw still in the game, winning their second round on Insurgents. Now 9-4 to four in favor of Cryo. So it looks like torn but whole. Torn but partial. Going to restart his game, I believe. Not sure if there's a pause coming out here. So, Torn coming back in the game here. I think a pause came out, but I cannot see. So, do, 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 do. Okay, so we're going to see a pause come out. Look how nice the gun models look on high. I always forget how like nice and shiny these gun models are. Because we all play in low. But yeah, uh, so beta this weekend. Hello? Hello, please. Uh, hello? So, Sandstorm beta this weekend. I took Friday off of work. Um, I think I'm going to do a 24-hour stream. So if you want to pop in at any time during 24 hours, maybe possibly see me die from a heart attack. Um, feel free. So, yeah. I am excited. Nine to four. Should see a lore here come out shortly. So, let's take a look. I don't know what I actually last replayed. So, let's, let's take a look at the last replay we had here. Oh, it was actually I have Oris almost getting on to B. That's what it was. So actually, if you take a look at this, I'm going to actually replay this. Check this out. I have Oris barely getting, Zoo almost not getting that cap there. So look at that. Oh, just, oh my goodness, barely getting it. But it did not matter. Tall brought it back and won that round. So, New Spark, I thought I was your favorite B player. Wow, okay. You're going to hear that in three minutes and probably forget what you told the chat, but I will forever remember. So thanks for tuning in, guys. 5v5 Firefight DGL. I am Link for the DGL Veritas. So there's the scoreboard for you, ladies and gentlemen. Torn with one kill. What's going on? He just reconnected. That's a bug. So 9-4. to four. Now going into the carry the two... 13th round. 14th round, excuse me. See? Still can't math. So. Zoo running on that B. Oh, is this going to be an A play? Oh, I see an A play coming and I see it go away. Muzzle getting naded. Face bomb now pushing through. He's Oh, see? Here's the problem. Face bomb should have looked down. Um, Oh, is he going to hit the palm tree? Is that palm tree hitting palm tree? Palm tree hits palm tree. Oh, it doesn't get a kill. Face bomb. Face bomb not looking down hole again. What is he doing? He needs to look down in that hole for that player. Meanwhile, Malbeast gets a kill onto tires. And Zoo's got B at 90%. Face Palm shooting wildly. Angry at the comments I made earlier. Now Doug Doge Dougie getting kills. Oh my goodness. But it doesn't matter because Zoo's gonna get that cap. But I have Oris again killing Zoo. Just a little too late. Oh, Malby should get the kill. He looks away. He looks away and his Eotech gets him killed. Meanwhile, I crash. So we're just going to cast here. Um, it was a 3v3 situation at the end. So it looks like Tall had control there. They were recapping the objective. Um, I am crashing more than I have ever crashed in the past six months. Um, on high quality. So really what it is is high quality that catches your game. So give me a second here as I come in. I'm opening the server browser, trying to join Texas 3. I've got caps lock on, though. This is going to slow me down. I'm trying to get back in the game. There we go. I am connecting. Let's see. With that Google Fiber, how fast I can connect into DGL Texas 3. Thank you. And we're back in the game here. Looks like we're still live. Toss trying to stay alive. Meanwhile, it's 4v2. 4v2 situation. And Torn has to be careful. There's a player right here. And somehow Asian didn't get the kill. Looks like Torn actually fell. And then face palm. Oh, woo -hoo -hoo. that was a sexy kill. Nine to five now. Ta bringing that back. Sorry for crashing. Here's a replay for 
consolation there. Torn getting that kill and then face bomb at the very end. Boop. Getting that kill on the top, making that five to nine. They are coming back. So. <laughs> so there it is. <laughs> Game of Trolls, F Dud. Thanks, F Dud, for promoting. <laughs> Of trolls, um, it's funny. We actually just ordered a bunch and are putting it back on Amazon. My buddy's actually taken over a little bit of it. Sold out on Amazon, raised on Kickstarter, but that doesn't matter. We are nine to five right now. Ta is trying to bring this back, and they need to do so quickly because I am sweating like a pig. Pigs don't actually sweat. That was a lie. Doge playing up an apartment. See if. Doge could actually peek out. Oh! Torn with a nice kill onto Zoo, stopping that B cap. Look at Muzzle now pushing onto B. Needs to get down prone. There we go. Face Palm now looking out of hole window. Ivorce has been killed here before. Has he learned anything? What will the critics say? Ivorce, he's going to take a left peek here. This is going to be dangerous. Oh! He still gets killed! Eye of Horus getting taken down. Face Palm with an amazing leap. Face Palm now jumping down. I don't think anyone heard him. Meanwhile, Muzzle captures B. Ooh. Oop. Face Palm getting a kill. Now it's a 4v3. What's going to happen? Asian going back. He knows that this player killed his teammate. Is Face Palm ready? Oh, Face Palm is. Face Palm's going off right now. Face bomb getting a kill, running into lower ice cream. Is there an upper ice cream? Party's just waiting for him. Yeah, he's going to get the frag. And now Muzzle! Muzzle with the quick refrag. I think Malbeast here is Doug. But look at Iavorus. Iavorus patiently waiting for that kill, and he's going to get it. So nine to six, ladies and gentlemen, Ta coming back. Could we see an upset? <laughs> Let's see what the replay cast there. And yeah, look at Muzzle with the refrag. And then the Malbeast pushing through. I have Oris played really well there. He just chilled and then eventually got the kill. So good play by them. Ta trying to come back here. And Facepalm did so well that round. I mean, he got two kills. That was awesome. So. Nine to six. D -d 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 DGL. It's in the game. So. Here's Asian. Just going to throw that smoke across. Now, is that going to open up the push across? Yes, it is. Here comes the smoke and the push. Oh, he's going to get flashbanged. Muzzle. Ooh. With the deny, now muzzle on T1. He says, no way, Jose. Oh, where's party going to throw this? Where's he throwing it? Where's he throwing it? Where's he throwing it? Is it going to be? Oh, it lands right in front of muzzle, but not going to get the kill. Meanwhile, look at Sue pushing through B. She wants that B objective. Oh, she got by the, the barrel player. Somehow getting by the barrel player, Torn's going to get taken down. And now it's just Doug. Doji. Now they know Boz has a feeling. But Hardy actually takes him out from balcony. Now 10 to 6. Whew, good spot by Party watching Security Arch for that flank. <laughs> so what's up everybody? What's up, New Spark Dictator, Knife Legs, Gins, uh, underscore TV. Zapatista, Caitlin Gracie, Battle Shotbot, and uh, Jolly Bear. So, ladies and gentlemen, it's first to 11. I mean, Cryo has Ta on the ropes right now. It is 10 to 6. If security, the blue team, win right now, it's game over. Or is Ta? I mean, Ta's come back here. If you know what I'm saying, Ta's come back from this position. Well, we see a return of Long. Oh, Asian getting a nade onto Muzzle. That's going to be super detrimental to Ta, but Facepalm answering. 
Face Swap needs to peek out of these windows. Oh, not peeking out of the windows. He's not going to get the kill on the boss. The free kill on the boss. And look at this control. Face Palm killing Asian. Oh, proning. Trying to stay alive. Oh, is he going to get the nade? This could be beautiful. Is he? Oh! Oh, Face Palm with the triple kill. Oh, my goodness. Replay that in a second. 2v2, Face Palm has gotten three kills. Three kills this round. 2v2, Face Palm keeping his team alive. He's not going to go quietly in the night. Meanwhile, Doug's going to touch this. Now, here's the problem. He is completely exposed to Zoo. Am I lying? Could I be lying? I could possibly be lying. We'll see when she peeks. Oh, oh, oh. Does she see his gun? No, she doesn't. She does not see it. Here comes Boz around the corner. Oh, Boz gets taken down. B has 75%. Zeus forced. Oh, oh, oh. She's going to go to B. Oh, wow. She wants blood. Oh, now she's going to go to C. She doesn't know what she's doing. She's going to spawn camp. Holy cow. I mean, she's got to get all these kills and cap an objective. I mean, she might be able to do it. And oh, the prone. She gets two. She gets two. She's trying to stay alive here. She's got to look out. There's someone to her right. She does not hear that player. Now she's going to try and go to C. 20 seconds remaining. She's going to have to touch this objective and move to B. Oh, she's reloading. And time is going to run out here, ladies and gentlemen. 10 seconds remaining. The block is here. And does she know it? Yes, she realizes it now. Oh, with a sick, nasty pre-fire onto muzzle. Zero. Two, one, zero, and that is it. Ta coming back. Dude, that play by face palm. That was sick. Let's watch, let's watch that nade again. Here we go. Alright, three, two, one, replay. Alright, I was watching the whole thing. Alright, here we go. He pulls out the nade. I fly over because I'm an expert cameraman. Throws it in. Party can't do anything. Blows him up. Oh my goodness. That was beautiful. That was sex book. I must say. All right, we're back here. It's 10 to 7. Let's get back in the zone. That was a beautiful play by Face Bomb. Holy cow. Oh, my goodness. That was beautiful. 10 to 7. Ta is bringing this back. <laughs> oh, my God. Asian trying to drop the 30 bomb. Face Bomb doesn't care, though. So, oh, there's a pre-fire. Oh, not getting anyone. They're playing the A play again. Oh, here comes the nade by party. Here comes the nade by party. He's not going to get anyone. Oh, there's another nade. A second nade. Oh, face palm still alive. We saw a kill, though. Doug gets taken down. Touring takes down Zoo. I have Oris getting taken down. I'm watching the map more than I'm watching the players. Face palm up above. Look at muzzle. Muzzle on B. Tor needs to go up into apps. He needs to protect his team. Oh, wait. He might get this tires player. Oh, he's in a dangerous spot. Torn shoots. Does that distract Asian? No, Asian's looking for the kill. Oh, he's going to get it. Oh, oh, that heavy armor. Muzzle playing fat. Oh, 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 face palm. Oh, face palm with the wall bang. Are you kidding me? Oh, my gosh. Dude, Torn ran right by boss. He's like, what just happened? I'm sorry. That was insane. Oh, Boz is going to get the kill. All right, Face Palm has to keep this alive. Okay, uh, let's see. Oh, this is, oh. All right, he's going to miss that kill. All right, this is a 1v2 situation. It's 10 to 7. All right, now he's going to hear the, uh. Oh, no! Oh, he gets killed. Face palm getting taken down by Asian, eleven to seven. That is the G G coming out. Wow, tall, bringing it back. Look at this wall bang um, that's coming up from Face Palm. Look at this. Sees the gun, wall bangs party through, and that was a beautiful play. Unfortunately, um, you know Asian there shooting at muzzle, muzzle with heavy armor. And this is actually just going to loop itself over back and forth. 
So GG's by both teams. I'm going to keep um, my game open so you guys don't know what's going on. Um, but I, that was a super exciting game. Um, both those teams have practiced all season. I mean, we scrim them all the time. Um, you know, Taw beat Cryo 11-8 in part one. And now Cryo beats uh, Taw 11-7. So, I mean... Who knows? Who knows in a best of three what would happen there. But Cryo is going to move on to the playoffs. Um, and, yeah, we will give you more matches next week. Sandstorm Beta this week weekend. I'm going to be playing 24-hour stream starting Friday on Linky Poo, Twitch.tv slash Linky Poo. Um, I know I'm going to see some of you guys there. Most of you guys probably pre-ordered. So I'm um, super excited for Sandstorm. Um, we got some big announcements coming for you guys soon. Um, and yeah, thanks for watching everyone. GG's to Cryo and Ta. Uh, we will see you guys uh, later. So, peace out.